Well, clearly, a political showdown has erupted. AIDMK in opposition has hit the streets and they are charging at the Chief Minister, MK Stalin. With the rising heat against the Chief Minister, why hasn't he met some of the victims? Why hasn't he announced what needs to be done in this case? AIDMK is on the streets and organizing these protests that have taken place. That's the big news coming in. Uh, you can uh, look at uh, the, the, you can see the AIDMK leaders wearing black. It's a hunger strike that they are on for a day. Meanwhile, more and more dead are being confirmed. Looks like a mass cremation that has happened in some areas uh, in Kalakurichi, where 63 people dead, many are still critical. Remember, family shattered, women mourning. And uh, the question then is on the government of the state that why and how was this even allowed and permitted? Was the administration not aware at all that a toxic liquor of this kind is being uh, sold to specifically the poor people at this time? So while the AIDMK leaders have said they, they will not be speaking much, they want to hold the protest uh, through the day, but they want to clearly step up pressure. But they're also claiming that it's not just about what needs to be done, that the opposition leaders are not even being allowed to make a mention of this in the assembly. They are being blocked and that's why wearing black, they have decided to sit on a protest. A terrible tragedy re there, remember, and many are saying that this is possibly the biggest tragedy that the state of Tamil Nadu has seen, specifically when it comes to an issue like this, which has happened in the past as well. And will it be the last time or not remains the big question. MK leaders continue to be sitting on protest while the women, and what a disturbing visual, the manner in which the women, where the men who have lost their life because of the toxic.